Good afternoon, everybody. Uh, welcome to the CKC channel. And um, yeah, today we have our first follower Sunday. Uh, so you get to challenge me if you want to. I see I got received one challenge uh, on, on Lee Chess already. Uh, so if you are watching, um, I think it's uh, Blackjacks1 or something like that. Just make sure to send me your Twitch name. Uh, you can even do it here. In fact, you can just pop me a message here on on in the stream chat uh, because my, my chat box is only for followers. So today is a followers challenge day. So you need to be a follower of my channel to be able to uh, to be to be eligible for 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 this challenge. And please also make sure that it's three minutes and two second increment and unrated. I think on leeches they say casual or something like that. So for for today, no ratings are, are on the on the chopping block. But uh, let's let's see. Let's have some fun. And um, yeah. So um, in fact, I think I need to quickly go to my. Uh, what did I need to do? I need to go to my, um, let's go to my profile quickly and get the, the team link. Of course, you need to first join my team as well. Don't forget to join my team. I'm going to post the team link in the chat right now. Um, There we go. That's my link for my for my team. So just join the, the team. I'll get a notification if you've joined and I'll accept you. And uh, once you've joined my team, just pop me a message in the stream chat. And uh, as soon as I see your your name in my in my chat box and I see that and then I'll accept your challenge. So so yeah. So let's get to um I think um what I'm gonna do is in the meantime. Ah, I receive. I I got a message here from from Blackjacks One. Let's see, Blackjacks One. Uh, so is your Twitch name? Yeah, Lazeric. So it's Lazeric. Let's go back. Hi, Calvin. My Twitch name is Lazeric. Okay, Lazeric. I don't know if you can maybe pop a message there on Twitch as well. But uh, yeah, you can re-challenge me, and I'll accept it pretty soon. I uh, just want to get everything ready here. Uh, um, I think what I can also do is maybe do some puzzles in the meantime before I start playing just to warm up a bit. Um, so let's see. Let's go to, I think I need to go to a different display. Let's, let's just go to... Let's leave this at the board. And then let's go to uh, my display, other window, where I can go to my puzzles. And um, yes, Chess Master one says challenge. So um, yeah, you are part of my team, and uh, and. Um, yeah, so you sh you can you can just uh, issue the challenge. Remember, unrated three plus two. And uh, let me just actually remember, Ruan. You need to challenge me. I'm not going to challenge you. So issue the challenge three minutes plus two second increment. Same goes for Lazeric as well. Uh, you guys can just issue the challenge, and I'll 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 start with the challenges soon. I actually just want to do something quick here. I want to add. Um, something, to uh, let's see, where am I now? I need to add my alert box. Just a moment. Okay, I've got my alert box in that one and in this one. And then of course, let's add um, myself in there. Okay, so I think 
this looks uh, decent. Let me just put myself in a bit better over there. Okay, so scariest name, what up? Uh, uh, welcome to the show. Uh, so, so like I told everybody thus far, you should um, you should just issue the challenge right now. In my inbox, I don't see anything. I saw a challenge from Black Jacks uh, a while ago. So just uh, just reach, uh, challenge me. I think uh, he said his name is Lazeric. If it's the Lazeric, I know. Welcome. So Lazeric, just uh, re reissue the challenge. And Chess Master Ruan as well. You should just issue the challenge. To remember, it's unrated three plus two. Scariest name, you are also welcome. And uh, yeah, uh, for everybody out there, um, if you want to challenge, you need to be a follower of, of my stream. So just pop me a message in my stream chat or on leeches. But you can just send me a message. Just say hi. Uh, you want to you want to challenge in in this in the chat box because then of course this is only a followers chat box. So if you if you're not a follower, you can't message me. Um, and for, and you need to join my leeches team by the way. So you must first join my leeches team and just. Say hi in the in the chat box, and then I will uh, start. So we will, we're gonna start with the challenges soon. Um, in the meantime, maybe we can uh, uh, while while the guys are issuing challenges, let's just um, let's just do some puzzles. Um, let's see now. In fact, I want to add some music here as well. Let's see if we can add some music. And uh, yeah, you guys must just let me know if the music is too loud. Um, let's let's make it slightly softer here yeah, on my side. Is that okay? Just let me know if it's too loud. So yeah, okay. So let's do some puzzles quickly in the meantime. And then if, if there's still no, ch no challenges, then I'm going to start playing. So uh, let's see. Music too soft, so I must put it up a bit louder, you say. Thanks for letting me know. Let me know if that's okay. Uh, okay, I see Ruan has challenged me 3 plus 2. So uh, yeah, I guess we can start with that. Just to get the, the, the blood flowing, let's, let's play. So uh, let's go over to, to this. And here we go. We've got our first challenge. Thanks, thanks for the update, scariest name. Okay, so here we go. Ruan uh, JVR. I think it's Janse van Rensburg. Let's go C5. So this is our followers Sunday, everybody. Just for my followers, especially for my followers. Um, let's change my display. I don't want to have my arrow all over. Okay, it's not there. Why is my display thing showing that? I don't want my mouse to show, but okay, in any event. Okay, let's see. Um, I'm gonna go D6. Go E5. And Mr. Ruan super fast on the clock right now. I'm gonna castle. Okay, so I'm gonna chase this knight and see what he's up to. Ah, nice one, serious name. Definitely not intended. Let's let's keep it uh, strictly chess. <laughs> Funny you point that out. Okay, let's say um, I'm gonna go rook b8. Uh, let's go h6. I wanna go bishop e6, but knight g5 would bother me. And for now, I'm gonna go a6. Let's see what the white is up to. Let's go bishop e6. And queen d7. Let's 
Let's go bishop h3. I think we can do this. Whew, going deep the scariest name. I think I think uh, you uh, you're on the wrong on the <laughs> on the wrong idea for this day. It's supposed to be uh, fun for the followers. Definitely not what you're talking about. Okay, let's see. So e4 was played. Um, what shall I do? I think I'll push. Just possibly open up the f-file. So it seems like my opponent has dropped a piece now. Too much pressure on the knight. Okay, maybe not a piece, but two pieces for a rook. I need to activate my pieces. Um, from h5, look at bishop h6. Let's just be slightly careful over here. Let's cover some squares. Queen is also eyeing b3. Queen c2. So now I think I'm going to go bishop h6. We should then go to e3. My knight wants to jump to d4 as well. It's just my knight on e7 that really wants to do something. But I think I'm going to go check. And then I'm going to go knight d4. My bishop can capture. Or maybe even pawn takes. Maybe I should play pawn takes. Then I have this knight c6 and knight e5 idea. Things are getting a bit hectic here, so... I guess I should... Uh, do I want to go into... Double-edged play? I guess I will. I'm a bit low on the clock here. My opponent playing really fast. Let's go knight c6. We can pre-move pawn takes bishop just in case he captures. So we win that pawn. E4 is also hanging. It's beginning to look good for me. Whoa, my opponent goes in for glory uh, with his king. Let's capture. But low on the clock here. Let's go h h4, maybe h3. And 
And I think that will be a nice finish over there. So you can't go queen g2. Should be mate. I think he should have tried to push his queen side pawns a long time ago. Okay, nice game, uh, Ruan. Nice game. Uh, nice speed on the clock. Um, I don't see any other challenges yet, guys. The floor is open for challenges. Just join my Lee Chess team. And let's quickly take a look at this game, Ruan. Um, so let's go back to the beginning. And um, so some some King's Indian structure for white. And uh, must say my opponent did give me uh, a lot of uh, problems over there. Looking at his rating, he's probably he's playing. He play probably plays stronger than his rating for this game. So um, knight to c4. Usually they would go e4 first. Maybe you should think about playing e4. And uh, whenever the knight goes to c4 and black does kick the knight, then the knight can go comfortably to e3 over there. Sometimes you go e4 and a4 as well. Um, but the typical uh, setup actually here for white is something like e4. Let's press analysis board. Forgot to press analysis board. So uh, the typical setup would be something like e4, knight g7 and c3 and a3. And then white, oopsie, white usually goes for pawn to b4. And then attacks the c5 square like that. Sometimes a b file can open up. And uh, sometimes you go bishop b2 or knight b3. Interesting stuff. And you can even aim for a d4 break. So, yeah, nice game there. Let's let's actually go back to the game itself. What happened. So knight c4. So lost a bit of time on knight c4, but nothing dramatic. c4. And um, Rook E1. I still think that somewhere E4 needed to come. Oh, sorry, no, not not with C4, maybe not. Um, but this knight on D2 is actually misplaced. He, he wants to land on D5, so maybe he needed to be on C3. Um, Bishop H3. And uh, yeah, it's a bit difficult with this king cut cut off like that. It's difficult to recommend. I think White lost a lot of time with that knight maneuver and. Not be putting a presence in the center, showing his presence in the center. So it's very difficult to come up with anything, yeah. So yeah, maybe just a setup there at the beginning, Ruan. Um, I would say if you go for C4 structures, then put the knight on C3 because a lot of times the knight jumps in their typical English stuff. Um, or you could play E4. You should actually play E4 and play it in King's Indian style. So yeah. Um, so, um, as you guys can see there as well, uh, just a reminder there of my YouTube, um, my YouTube channel. Uh, go check it out. I uploaded one or two new stuff on there. And, um, and, uh, yeah, as well, that's my email address at the top, Calvin Class and Chess, um, at gmail.com. So um, email me if you need online coaching or any anything related to CKC Chess. So uh, let's get back to the puzzles for now. If there's no other challenges, Lazeric, where are you? I thought you challenged me. Uh, so let's go back to puzzles. Played excellent, Ruan. I don't know if you heard my analysis just before. Uh, played excellent, put me under pressure on the clock. Uh, you didn't make any obvious mistakes. Uh, I think it's just your setup there. Uh, eventually giving me too much activity and uh, you should have either put the knight on c3 in an English if you have c4 this knight move was knight c4 and knight d2 back just slow down things um, okay I see here black checks has challenged me um, I would have loved the uh, Lazeric to just give me a me proper message on the chat I don't know why he isn't doing that but I'll accept so yeah yeah definitely you played excellent Ruan well done Okay, here we go, another English. Let's go G6 this time. Let's go C5. Looks like the guys have been trained in English. Okay, so he, usually I play that setup for black. So now my opponent is playing it for white. So I'm going to try something different here. Just for fun.
So my opponent didn't put a knight on f3. I can threaten some funkiness there. And my phone is just vibrating off the hook here. I don't know why. Okay, so d4 that early. Um, what am I gonna do here? I'm just gonna go bishop d7 for now. I don't know if that's right, but I don't want to exchange queens. Grab some coffee. So my opponent taking his time here. Blackjack C1. A3. Okay, so I'm gonna go rook B8 just to see. I mean, he's got this B4 at some point. B7 can hang. Do a prophylactic move. H4 next. Okay, let's go H4. I'm, I'm playing around too much here. Giving my opponent so much time to do what he wants to do. Okay, so B4. Let's take on D4. I'm gonna go knight h6. I don't know if it's good or bad. Let's play some interesting stuff. It's got this b5, knight a5, c4 will be hanging. That's why rook on beard is useful so I can play b6 at least in case the knight isn't gets into trouble. But I'm not convinced with my play though. It's like I'm not doing anything and not everything right, but. Okay, so that's a bit surprising. Bishop f3, very surprising to me. Let's go knight f5. This pawn is hanging. So I don't understand my display capture. Yeah, it's still showing. I don't know why, but my arrow is still showing. So what's my opponent gonna do about that pawn over there? Scariest name are you still out there? Is the music to your to your liking? So Bishop B3, I have the option of capturing. What to do, what to do. Okay, so let's take over there. Aha, interesting stuff, yeah. 
So I think I'm thinking long, but I think my opponent is thinking longer. I'm gonna take this bishop, it just looks juicy to take. I don't know if that was right. It's tempting him, tempt him into playing e4. Whoa, what is that? I don't understand that one. Giving up the bishop. I guess my opponent wanted d5 square. I don't know what I'm doing is right, but okay. I think his king is overloaded. Okay, so the pawns drop. Must say my mouse is not doing what I wanted to do. Excellent game there, uh, Black Jacks, Lezeric, well done. And um, yeah, you got me on the ropes there for a while. I was a bit nervous on the clock. So uh, let's take a look at this. So if there's any other challenges, uh, floor is open. Join my um, join my uh, Leeches team that I post. I think I did post. Uh, yeah, it's at the top of the chat. Just uh, check it out. Uh, join my Leeches uh, team on Leeches. Or you can go to my profile and just see on the right. You'll get the link. Uh, or you can go under community and um, teams and just search CKC. Make sure it's a Calvin class and chess team. Okay, so um, yeah, scary his name says he's, he's, he's in the matrix here. Um, I hope you took the blue pill. Lovely, lovely game, Lezeric. Uh, definitely seems like you've improved, eh? So well done. Tough game. Let's take a look at this game actually. Let's go to analysis board. <laughs> so let's go back. So another English. English is so difficult to crack. <clears throat> and uh, like I said, this the setup that White is playing is actually um, is actually what. But I like to play for black. <coughs> so, um, yeah, so so it's, it's a bit difficult. If I just go, um, if I go, let's say I go e6 here, and white goes there, and I go there, and castle, and castle, and d4, and it becomes very dry. It's not so um, nice to play from the black uh, side. It's definitely playable. But I mean, after something like, um, um, let's say, pawn takes pawn, I don't know, knight, pawn takes there and there, something like this. Either you go, either you go pawn takes or knight takes, but it's still not um, pleasant to play it from the black side, of course. So, I mean, black can also play d6, I guess. But that's why I prefer changing over to this with d6. <coughs> I can also play e5 immediately. But I decided on uh, h5, so something interesting. May maybe something to consider for white um, lizard. Maybe you can go h3 here. 
Don't know if it solves everything, but at least if black goes h4, then you can go g4. Especially if you haven't castled, then it's not dangerous at all for you. And you've gained some space and... I mean, even that knight maneuver to f5 is not possible. So, okay, so d4 immediately, bishop d7, a3. So typical stuff, typical English stuff. Um, b4... I didn't like bishop f3. Maybe you should have, you could have waited for me to play h3 because then the pressure is off the pawns. Um, so I didn't like bishop f3. Maybe you can continue with your bishop e3 or something. It's difficult for white though because you need to castle at some point to do something because you've thrown all these pawns on the queen side forward. Um, but okay, bishop f3 doesn't throw it away. Knight f5, bishop e3. And I feel like this is probably not too bad for white. You've got a huge center. I've got the bishop there, but I can't use my bishops at the moment. And I think that, okay, that's a blunder, I think. A positional blunder. I, there's no need to give up your bishop for the for the knight over there. The bishop still has a lot of um, uh, uh, um, control of that diagonal. The knight has no obvious way of going forward yet. So I think that was a mistake, giving up your bishop like that. It made it easier for me. I could see the motivation with the knight jumping in perhaps over there. Maybe I could have just left it like that even. Knight f4, okay, I guess this is just a time scramble. Just a time scramble because... Um, both sides, we it's not easy to come up with a strategy. But okay, my bishops, you can see clearly my bishops is a problem here for white. White's king can't run. The king goes this way to run. Maybe sometimes the bishop can land there. Especially because I want to bring over my rook. So it's difficult. I think giving up your light squared bishop was, a, was an issue over there. Okay. So, um, yeah. Floor is still open, guys. This is our days for challenges. If I don't get any more challenges, I'm going to do some puzzles. And or I'm going to play some, some blitz. Either way. Just checking out my messages here. Lots of messages coming in. Yeah, definitely. So, you must have a really good reason for, for giving away your bishop for the knight. Um, you must calculate something. Okay, I'm going to get this, bam, 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 and then I'm better, or I'm going to win a pawn or something like that. But not just... You're, instinctively, if you don't have much time, you should not want to give up your bishop for, for the knight. So, yeah. But excellent game, Lezeric. Well played. Well played. You took me down to... Oh, I almost lost on time there. So, yeah. Okay. Any more challenges, everybody? The floor is open. Join my leeches team and uh, challenge me underrated 3 plus 2. Um, yeah, in the meantime, I think, I think I might just play some Blitz, actually. This music is actually getting me into the mood to, to play Blitz. So, I'm going to play more Blitz for now. Let's go three minutes, uh, probably three minutes, let's try three minutes straight. I don't know how am I going to do this. Uh, for some reason, my mouse is giving me grief today. Maybe I should have taken a, an in increment, actually. I forgot that my computer can sometimes be slow while, while streaming. Seems to be, seems to be decent. Okay, so it's King's Indian. Uh, I'm not going to share my number um, on this channel, Master One. You can contact me on on um, on Leeches. You can send me a message on Leeches. Let's go H3. So F6 was played. Strange. So. Um, I'm gonna play something funny here. Let's go bishop c1. Let's go bishop e3 now.
My opponent is definitely in blitz mode here and I'm playing around. He has used 10 seconds, wow. Wow. I'm definitely not in the blitz mode here. I think that increment games made me a bit asleep. Okay, I see another challenge over there. Please just send me your name, whoever it is in the chat box. Uh, make sure you that you've joined my Leeches team as well. I'll check now who the challenge is. I'm very behind on the clock here. Um, Okay, thanks Gary's name for popping in. See you next time. Good luck with your lesson. So I managed to recover here, but now I need to just keep the pace on the clock. So knight f4, knight h5 is ideas, bishop h6 as well. Double up on the D file. Knight looks very juicy on F4. And it's covering. Yeah, okay, I was gonna say it stops queen exchanges. Wait, isn't that just a blunder? It's a free piece. Free queen at that. <laughs> My opponent playing too fast for his own good. Okay, so let's check out who is the challenge. Aha, so Snowflakes is also uh, part of my um, Leeches um, team, so of course I'll accept that. So here we go. Okay, good luck Snowflakes, here we go. I think I might have played Snowflakes uh, in one of my summers before. She she always gives me a, a tough time. Let's go e6. So Catalan, one of my favorite openings. Let's throw in a check. Let's drop back. You might ask why the mysterious check that's part of modern theory sometimes the bishop is misplaced away a lot of times in a cat land you double fianchetto and the queen is also slightly blocked over there but nothing dramatic i'm choosing some slav setup very solid so it might be seven to b3 I'm gonna jump in over there just before the knight lands on c3 does white want to keep his bishop or not that's the question Interesting.
Okay, so I'm gonna take. I think I'll go B6, finish my development. <coughs> A typical structure in the Catalan over there. Um, in fact, I had this type of structure in the essay close against Kenny Solomon. Didn't work out too well for me in that game though. But, um, yeah, typical stuff. I guess I'll take Bishop B7. Uh, Chief Master One, you can email me. Um, yeah, you've got my email. I guess I have to go rook c8. <clears throat> I'm expecting queen b4, that would have been interesting. Um, it's a fight for some dark squares over there. to take my dark squares are weak um, what to do Some ideas. So the pawns are on the nice color for white, but I think that was a mistake by white giving up the open file. And I'm gonna do this. Ask for double pawns, but my rook will be super active. E2 will also hang. Queen G5 looks like a good move. Thank you. 
watch out for mite. Oof, and I managed to come back. Wow, this followers is not giving me any uh, any easy games. Well done to Snowflakes for excellent game. Wow, I was actually thinking you were doing quite good at some point. Um, well done, well done to Snowflakes out there. Uh, thanks for challenging. And um, the challenges are open, guys. Um, and do tell your friends about it by the way we are having followers Sunday from now on um, so I will try to do this every Sunday for just my followers and um, yeah so let's have a look at the game let's have a look at the game put on analysis board D4. So the setup I'm choosing is a slightly modern setup, uh, including the check, because the the point of it is White would of course like to play Knight C3 over there, but then Black can be cheeky enough to to capture, and then try to keep the pawn with B5, or sometimes just go Knight, sometimes just Knight B6 or so, or take the time while white tries to get the pawn back to play e5 and open up the position in, in Slav, typical Slav style. Um, but um, so, so that's why that's a very logical move played by a lot of people, b3. Um, and this is the whole point why the check is there. The bishop b4 check is there just to lure the bishop out to d2 in this specific line i've seen a lot of games where white goes knight c3 and black actually captures the bishop and then goes f5 with a with a, um, a type of a, what do you call it a dutch a stonewall setup and you can go knight f6 later on knight e5 perhaps or queen e7 b6 bishop e7 so yeah um some some players just play f5 straight away um, so probably um, oh maybe what i would recommend for white if he doesn't want to lose the bishop is maybe play bishop c1 that's another idea bishop c1 and then knight bd2 or knight c3 and bishop b2 try to get into some more familiar catalan stuff even though what white did is also typical catalan stuff with bishop f4 and White actually got a decent position here. Takes, takes. I don't know what I should have done here. Maybe the computer will tell me. Um, there was something a bit more straightforward. I felt like somewhere I, I must try to get in C5, but White didn't give me time. Can I go C5 here? Doesn't look like it. So, seems like White did a good job here to take immediately. <coughs> E takes doesn't look right to me. Yes, I want to get in C5 so, he, so desperately, but that bishop is going to become strong with that D pawn being weak. So I guess I had to play C takes. But I've got a feeling the engine is going to is gonna like this for black somehow. I have a feeling. I don't feel it. Yeah, I thought white could maybe play bishop B, queen B4. That was what I was pondering uh, on so long for. Because now I can't play queen e7. And white can even um, go queen d6 perhaps afterwards. 
So I was thinking about this and I had, I had an idea. Maybe this is not very convincing, but maybe Queen B8 eating F4. But now I'm thinking about it, maybe this is still very good for white. Can white play Queen D, Queen E7 or something? Queen E7. Maybe I couldn't do this. I, I think Queen B4 was quite strong here, yeah, I think. Um, Bishop A6. I guess it's a possibility, but I don't see how it's helping matters. It's knocking E2, but... Um, I don't know. Does white need to protect that pawn? I guess rook e1. Takes, takes, takes. I so badly want to get in queen d6, but maybe this is not happening. Let's see what the engine says here after bishop a6. Engine says it's about equal. Uh, white should play rook takes c8. Queen takes c8. I guess bishop a6 is quite bishop a6 is quite a nice move because it forces some. Aha! So bishop a6 strong move, yeah. And and the computer agrees with with me. It said queen b4 is is a decent move, but bishop a6 excellent move. Wow. Okay. So that was the move. So my opponent played queen d2, and that gave me queen e7, and I think I'm relatively comfortable here. Besides the fact that uh, my bishop is quite bad, that's why I played bishop a6 later. But the point is, in this close position, a lot of times you find yourself in these Catalan positions where you have a good bishop, but now this bishop can't be utilized at the moment. Because he's looking at that pawn as well. Maybe a long term bishop f1 and out, but it takes so long, and my bishop can go to a6 any moment. So it's not easy for white to claim me as an advantage. And then d4 pawn, okay, we can always play e3. So it should be balanced, but I kind of like what I did here. a5. And this queen b4 is always in the air. King h1, maybe trying to utilize the g file. Bishop a6. Yeah, I think that was a blunder. Rook c2, snowflakes, that was a blunder. I was expecting something like rook g1 here, actually. But probably I would continue with queen b4. And that would maybe just accelerate your attack, what happened. Because after queen b4 you can go queen g5 immediately. And there could be some drama. So I think white was actually doing not too bad here. <coughs> Rook c2 was a blunder. That gave me momentum, that gave me the open, the, file, uh, the open file. And I could pick off some pawns over there. And this was a time scramble. So well done um, Snowflakes, excellent game. It seems like every follower that challenges me, the time control, uh, my time gets less and less. I'm getting close to losing one. But strong, strong followers. So yeah, open uh, uh, challenges are open, guys. Challenges are open. Three plus two, unrated. Join my leeches team and um, come and challenge me. S pop me a message in the stream chat just to show that you're a follower, and then we can get cracking. So, in the meantime, I think I'm going to play another Blitz game. Maybe one more Blitz game and then I'm going to switch over to some puzzles. I uh, might take like a five minute break and then switch over. Maybe we must do some, some puzzle rush on chess.com. Okay, so I noticed that my time is a bit slow. I I'm gonna give myself an increment for this game, even though I don't want to, but okay, well, the challenges were 3.2. So let's do 3.2 for this one. Come on, clicking. What's happening here? Ah, I'm not clicking on the right thing. <laughs> okay. Okay, it seems like I'm playing a, a strong opponent. Let's go with a King's Indian.
four pawns attack. Dangerous. My opponent uh, wants to crush me. Let's go e6. Is he gonna take on e6? Let's free move pawn takes pawn. Yes, he does take on e6. This is tricky stuff. I think I should go knight d4. Oh, this is one famous game of Kasparov, but uh, the theory I'm not too clued up in, so. Um, I'm gonna go, so I think the move was knight g5 that Kasparov played, uh, that, that was played against Kasparov in that game. I'm gonna go bishop d7 here. Queen e7, bishop c6. With an idea. So we have, um, for now, we're gonna, I'm gonna try to get a regular schedule going, like I said, guys. So for Fridays, we have our Friday opening um, openings night, and then Sundays, we have our follower Sundays. I think I want to play bishop c6 here. Just to play b6 in time if he goes b4. I want to get my bishop on that diagonal. I'll go b6. Okay, so he's challenging my knight on d4. This knight on c3 is hanging. So I feel like going knight h5 here. Knight g4, he'll just go bishop g1. And if I take, he goes queen takes, I can take his knight. But then my knight is hanging as well, and e6. So I want to go knight h5 here. f4 is also hanging. And I'm keep an, keeping an eye on the c3 knight. But things are not looking too great here for him, I think. <clears throat> Probably has to move this knight. Knight e2, but then I can I can capture the knight and take on f4, can I not? I think he dropped the pawn now. Well. So I'm a pawn up uh, and there's no knight g5. Okay, now I keep the bishop on the diagonal, I suppose. Queen e7. We double up. Let's double up. Okay. Is that just a blunder? I think so. And now I'm going to torture my opponent with the opposite color bishops. No, should I do that? Because d6 is hanging. Still feel like doing it though. No, maybe I shouldn't. Maybe I can, I'm going to do it. I'm gonna plant my bishop on d4 or e5. Maybe e5. Maybe e5 is better. You got rook h4, queen h4, h2 could be problematic. f3 is still hanging. Go queen h4. Maybe queen h5. Queen h5, rook h4 is a possibility.
my opponent is defending stubbornly. Oh, rook takes. What is that? What am I missing here? Back rank is weak. Back rank is weak. Do I have enough time to finish this off? Yes, rook takes bishop, queen takes queen takes e6 check, but everything is protected of mine, so he might have a perpetual on and he goes for it. Ah, seems like he's getting away with a perpetual. Oh my word. Oh no. He snatches a draw over there. Okay, let's let's analyze this quickly. I just want to see what that evaluation was. Could I escape? The mouse is not giving me confidence to play fast here. It says it's equal, yeah. I've got a feeling I was hustling there though. For a moment. With those tactics. Ah, rook h1, king g2, rook g1. It's difficult to see. Rook h4 check. Bishop g3. Ah, bishop g3 immediately. Bishop g3 immediately, then there's no funny business. I'll take on g3 with check. Okay, that was a blunder. What did I have here? If I take, and he takes here, check. Ah, just King G7. What was I thinking? Okay. Anyway. So, um, yeah, so challenges are still open, guys. Um, I think I am going to take a small break, and then maybe if there's no other challenges for now, then I will do some puzzles on Puzzle Rush. And, but if you still want to challenge, it's still open. Um, let's just post my team link quickly again. If you're wondering why you cannot chat in my chat box, then it is because of... Um, you need to first follow me. Sign up to Twitch, it's for free. And then you come back to my channel and you uh, press, press the follow button. That's my team link and join my team 3 plus 2 um, casual uh, game and um, yeah just pop me a message. Okay so uh, let's let's actually just um, take a break guys and we will talk soon. Back we'll be gonna be back for puzzles.
Okay, I am back. And uh, like I said, the, the floor is still open for uh, challenges, everybody. So I'll check my lead chest just in case there's anyone that still uh, throws in a, a um, challenge. But for now, I'm going to switch over to some puzzles. Um, stay warm, so to speak. And um, let's just, uh, I just want to leave this thing. On, on something else quickly. Um, yeah, I think it's it's fine over here. Okay. Let's move me a bit there. Okay, and uh, let's do some three minute puzzle rush. Let's see. What I can do in this one, let's get our music going again. Okay, here we go. Puzzle Rush, three minutes on chess.com. Run, run, run. Three queen. Which way? This way. This way. <coughs> I guess it has to be Chick and Mike. Sometimes I struggle to see who, who's who. Oh no! Okay, 28, not too bad for a three minute one. So, um, yeah, let's go again. Uh, the one that I got wrong, let's check the one that I got wrong. Not too bad, I at least warmed up with those uh, games. Usually I start off poorly at this puzzle rush. Okay, so I played the Rook E8, what should I have done here? Um,
Obviously, I have Bishop takes pawn, but. Ah, Rook takes c2, maybe. Rook takes c2, yeah. And take and the knight drops as well. Okay, let's go again. Wait, it's check. What? Oh, 95 check. 95 check. Okay, 26 a bit worse, but okay. Let's check out the ones where we got wrong. 23, double attack. I wanted to play a rook takes, king takes, and queen. 23 check. But why not just win the piece? It was better over there. Of course, the rush taking a hold of me over there, I was low on, on, low on the clock. 95 check was such a nice move. I wanted to play 95, but it was check. The so bishop protects the knight. Okay, here we go. I wanna get to 30. I think 30 is my record in 3 minutes. Looking for might, I should just grab the queen.
Did I just mate? Not just mate. What's going on here? No man! No! Whose move is it? It's white to play here. It's check, so I guess I have to take. What's happening here? What? Why am I blind? Yeah, super slow for this one. Woof. Oh, okay. Um, yeah, uh, Ruan, um, challenges were quite uh, um, challenging. Uh, Snowflakes gave me a tough time later on as well, and, and Blackjacks. But not a lot of challenges today, so guys, tell your friends about it. If you want to come challenge me, um, I think there might be some Corona Wars on as well right now. So, um, so yeah. But in any event, uh, it's been interesting and I'm doing some puzzles right now. So, flow is still open for, for challenges if you want to um, if you want to challenge me. 3 plus 2. Um, yeah, obviously someone that hasn't challenged yet. So, um, flow is still open. If you think your buddy would like to play me on live on Twitch, then get him to, jo get him to join my team and uh, do a, a, a send me a message um, in the chat. Okay, let's quickly take a look at the two wrong ones. Look takes G2. Why did I not look at that? My word, I've got another rook on the board. Okay. Oh yeah, definitely I was going blind over there. Okay, so this is an interesting one. I bet king back, wanting to go H5, H4. What should I do? G3? Yeah, I guess G3. G3, F3 and then King back. Yeah, because if I go King G5 first, then White can maybe play G3 first. So I had to go G3. And if Pawn takes Pawn, King takes, and then I take the Pawn and then I run. If F3 <coughs> or F4, now I can just move the King and push the H5 Pawn up. So yeah, um, interesting. Uh, this Pawn, King Pawn, um, Puzzles are actually interesting. Okay, here we go. Let's go for another one. What? Did I miss something? Missing these setters.
Damn it. Okay, so I'm swerving around that mark. Uh, let's check out this one actually. Bishop takes knight or what? Ah, rook takes knight, rook takes knight. Rook takes knight. Okay, and the one I got wrong. Wait, I wanted to play d5 to get in bishop takes knight. The bishop was already open over there, wow. Again, some blind blindness over there. Bishop takes knight just straight away and then the fork. That's what I wanted to do, but I thought I have to first play d5 to get that in. Okay, um... Okay, I'm enjoying this, so let's go again. What the... what... what... What color am I? I'm... No, rook, rook takes pawn and then queen h falls, mate. Sully, sully, sully. And then they give me this one. Man. What is going on here? I'm getting worse and worse here. <laughs> okay, interesting stuff. Uh, 25, not too bad, but okay. Got a couple wrong here, let's go. Okay, so rook takes pawn and queen h4, mate. Wow, I don't believe I missed that one. Can't believe I missed that one. I took the bishop, just mate on c1.
What am I thinking? Uh, this is a Magnus Carlsen uh, game. Let's check over there. Might. Yeah, this was one of Magnus Carlsen's games when he was still a young, young player. What is this? This is a hanging. This is Might. I guess I take the draw. Oh my word, I got 30 man, I just finished the puzzle. Like a second too late, so okay, at least I'm happy with that. Like I said, 30 is my record, I think, on this thing. Um, for 3 minutes, so that is a nice round number for 3 minutes. How much is that per minute? That's 10 per minute, that's 10 puzzles per 60 seconds, so it's 6 seconds per puzzle. That's decent. So yeah. Um, yeah I think I'm gonna continue until maybe, maybe, maybe 10 more minutes, then I'll... I'll call it a day. Uh, if you still want to challenge, you know what to do. Send me a message. No puzzles wrong that time, so. One is spoiling me. What's going on? What? What did I do there?
Okay, bombed out over there. Let's check. Let's check. Uh, why don't I play in the Corona? Um, I've got lots of projects that I handle, so I didn't. I actually commented on the last Corona. Um, but yeah, I I don't have too much time for that. I've got lots of projects that I am doing. I'm sure I'll play in a Corona once or twice. Um, let's see. So I played Queen takes look. What was the issue here? Queen i6 check and then just pick up the queen. When is it going to be my tournaments? Uh, are you talking about uh, the tournaments in my in my team, my team tournaments? Right. I I told uh, I said the other night that um, I will have a an arena tournament before the before the month is done. So we will have our first one before the end of the month. It's probably close to the end of the month, and I'll I'll announce. But I will announce that in my team. I will I will send a note, uh, a message for everybody in the team. That's why it's important to join the team so that you don't miss out on these notifications. Okay, so that one I got wrong. Now I know why. Sorry. Okay, so I I pinned, but then you could probably play bishop b8. This is probably I'll just take the bishop. So I could win the queen, but bishop b8 would save it for the moment. Okay, this was totally crazy. What is going on here? Bishop g3 check. King d1 and queen f1 mate. I don't know how I must bishop g3 check. Okay, uh, I'm think I'm gonna do one more puzzle, guys. One more puzzle rush. Um, what's happening here? My mind was on something else now. Uh, I've, I've got the white pieces. What? I'm missing all these night moves. Queen D5 
Okay, 27 it is for me today. 27 is haunting me. Um, can you please make the tournaments in the afternoon? Um, afternoon. Yeah, I'll, I'll probably try to, to do something decent. Uh, obviously, I need to keep in mind the other tournaments as well that people have. But yes, I, I, I doubt I will have a tournament too late. But depending on my schedule and so on, um, I'll try to make it comfortable for everybody, yeah. Okay, so 27. Can't believe I got this one wrong. Queen b5 first. Then the other one. I played rook takes f2, but, but the knight will capture the bishop. So probably bishop takes f2 and bishop takes e1. It's simple, then you take the knight. Okay, I can't actually let it go like this. I'm gonna do one last one. There we go, guys. This is really the last one for me. Whether I get 20 or 19 or 27. What? And if you only knew just how much the sun needs you, Mouse, please don't fail me now. No, mouse, please. Ah, oh, I'm so slow. Twenty seven again, okay. <laughs> like I said, maybe twenty seven is my number for today. But okay, um uh let's let's stop there for today. Interesting challenges. I'd love to see more challenges, so tell your friends about uh, the challenge day. From now on, we'll have it every Sunday. Uh, if you feel like, if you're keen on challenging me, um, 3.2, join my Liches team. And uh, on Sunday, you can even just issue the challenge on the Sunday, and I'll get to the challenge. Um, you don't necessarily have to wait until the show is on. Leave the challenge on there, and then when it's time for the show, then I'll just start accepting challenges. Um, I've I've seen Gata Kamski them um, on their streams. When I see the challenges, it's like 85 or something like that, and then he just goes down the list. 
So, so yeah, so that's what we're going to do every Sunday, uh, follow us Sunday. And um, I took the pawn us, oh, so the bishop takes bishop and then take the knight. Sully of me. And that's about it. Yeah. Uh, okay. Um, uh, I I only do my own events, uh, Ruan. So if you want to talk business with me, please email me. Please do not ask these questions on stream uh, uh, to me. I am not going to answer you with these type of questions that you're giving me. So please follow the protocols. Let's keep it fun. Let's keep it uh, only chess for this. So if you have questions and things that you want to ask me, email me or send me a message on leeches. Okay. All right, so I hope you guys enjoyed the stream. Um, I, I definitely enjoyed the challenges, so uh, I hope to see more challenges next week. But uh, that's it for today. And uh, I hope you enjoyed the games. And I hope you guys have a nice um, rest of your Sunday. See you guys um, next week. Cheers.